Hello, good morning guys. Okay, today we're going to start again with our science class. Okay, as usual, uh, today we're going to discuss about uh, a new topic today, Unit 8, Absorptions. So, I need you to take up your textbook and flip through to page 71, the new topic, Unit 8, Absorptions. Then, as you can see here, the absorptions is those of you don't have your textbook then you can refer to the video okay uh, as you can see here the absorption next to absorptions word is a uh, tissue paper what is the connection absorption with the tissue paper okay let's hear the first picture here what happened to the picture you can see they are raining raining right raining so these two boys, they one of them are wearing a raincoat. You know raincoat, raincoat, baju hujan. And then the other one is uh, using a umbrella. Okay. Then the next picture, the 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 boys who wearing the raincoat is try to help the chicks. Okay. He see he saw a chick here, then he try to help. Then he uh, brought the chick back to the home here and here you can see here okay the chick the the the, the question is uh, why are Hafiz's shirt and the chick's feathers not wet why they are not wet okay uh, one of them are put they, they put the Hafiz uh, Hafiz put the raincoat here and he here's the chick and then the thing is as you can see uh, they are not wet why why they are not wet Okay. okay, this is what we want to learn today. Water absorbent objects, non water absorbent objects. Some syrup spill onto a glass table, then Alia wipe off the spill. Okay, you can see here the glass spill, tumpah, okay, the syrup. And what she do, she try wipe it, and then after she wipe, she can see anymore. No, no, no more syrup on the glass table. Why? Okay. Uh, so let's investigate. There is water absorbent or not? Okay. Yes, you can see here there are ten objects. Are the spoolo object? These ten objects. Uh, we want to know either the object is water absorbent or not. So you can do this activity at home and try to. Uh, investigate which object is the water uh, absorbent then if let's say coin drops of water yes you can see the water there yes then you can see yes handkerchief is a drop of water then what happened to the water it, uh, what happened to colored water okay if you cannot see it anymore so you can put no like that okay so in the box here, the glass table does not absorb water. The hand towel absorb water. There are water absorbent objects and non water absorbent objects. Okay. Uh, penyerapan. Okay. Some of the objects boleh menyerap air dan ada beberapa objek lain yang tak dapat menyerap air. Ah, that's what we want to know. Okay. There are various objects in the kitchen area. Okay. Uh, straw, glass, metal spoon, plastic plate, doormat, hand towel, kitchen paper, and mop. Okay, which one has a good water absorbent? Okay, yang mana? Huh? Okay. Ini, this is also a good activity you can you can do in your in your class. Uh, in sorry, in your home. Okay. Object, the water absorbent, and then water absorbent. You can, you can classify. Okay, the ability of material to absorb water. Okay, now, we know already that some of the object can absorb water. Some of the object can, cannot absorb water. So, which one have a better uh, or more water, absorb more water? Which object? Okay, for example, we have the cloth, kain, and we have the other one is a pepper, kertas. Both of these, we know that they can absorb water very well. But which one is absorb more water? Which one? Okay, a better, more absorbent material. 
this is also you can do this activity at home okay we you need to have three types of this strips cut newspaper uh, kitchen paper and clothes okay you can put uh, all of these three strips into the beaker containing colored water and leave it for one minute tunggu satu minute and absorb which one has uh, absorbed by the three object the water level aras air water level okay then you can come out with this conclusions the object that absorb water the most is the kitchen paper and the object that absorb water the least is the newspaper okay that's all for today uh, i need to recap first okay today we learn we learn about absorption penyerapan dan ob, ada objek yang penyerapan baik boleh menyerap air ada yang tak boleh menyerap air dan bagi kita boleh juga boleh compare objek yang boleh menyerap air better yang lebih baik okay so that's all for today thank you for watching happy learning bye absorb more okay that is the the investi investigation you want to want to see okay if you understand here i try to conclude for today okay this topic we want to understand the absorb uh, observation uh, about the absorption okay about the absorption so the absorption penyerapan that we know that some of the material or object can absorb liquid water and so on okay cecair boleh menyerap cecair okay dan ada objek yang tak boleh menyerap cecair okay bila kita dah faham tu bagus okay tak semua objek boleh menyerap cecair dan apabila ada beberapa jenis objek yang boleh menyerap air kita juga nak kenal pasti Objek mana yang boleh menyerap air dengan lebih baik? Uh, absorb water more, okay? Absorb more water. Uh, jadi itu yang kita kena faham pada hari ini. Okay, thank you.